Welcome back to Banjo-Tooie, also known as The Great Backtrack Debacle, Part 1. Oh good, and we have Dragon Kazooie, so everything is right with the world. Yep, we got Dragon Kazooie, and uh, we just got a whole whole mess of things to, 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 to get here. Are we starting with Cheeto? Nope, uh, we don't have all the pages that we- we'll, we'll get Cheeto at the- at the very end, but, uh, okay. there's something here we're missing. What? Yeah. You mean you've kept this from me the entire time? Well, kept from? Didn't know about? Take your pick. Okay. Ooh, something in the wa- Oh, yeah! yeah. Oh, Alright, so first off, let's launch Kazooie here. <laughs> let's launch the dragon! Oh, that just- That looks painful. Yeah. Existence nice. is pain. Oh, it's a Jinjo! It's a Jinjo! Jinjo! Yoink! Spiral Mountain's only Jinjo! Oh, that's kind of cool. Yeah. So you definitely have to come back for it. Ide ideally here is when you get the, the goldfish as well, but, you know. Yeah, when did we get the uh, the torpedo? Was that the water level, or...? That, I think that was, uh... Four? Jolly Rogers Bay, I think? Jolly Rogers Bay? Lagoon, I mean? Okay, Jolly Rogers Bay is from Mario 64. Can I get it right? Come on, come on, come on, come on. <laughs> do, 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 I know I'd rather go there, but still. Alright. Woo! Couple more things here to get. First one is, let's see. It, uh, aha! Oh, there's a little hidden alcove there. I wonder what that could be. Let's go see. I'm a gonna reckon it's another Jinja. Oh wait, you said it's the only one there. That's yeah. Uh, Cheeto page. Then. No more Jinjos. Uh, no more Cheeto page. We we got everything. Now we're getting into the stop and swap two bullshit. Uh, oh. So behind the waterfall is. Oh, is that another cartridge? Yes. Hey, it's another cartridge. You think? Well, how do I get in there? What's I up, mean... cartridge? Oh wait, hello bar. Uh, hey, what's up, cartridge? It's a BK cartridge. Ow! Ow. <laughs> okay, uh, how about... It's supposed to oh. grip grab over here. Oh, look at all this little secret doodads. I about like it! here, uh-huh, yeah. See, I miss games that had, like, little secrets that you can go find. Uh, it's another egg. Egg. See, I think this offers, uh, different unlockables that you give to Heggy. Mm-hmm. Because, you know, that first one was Dragon Kazooie, and that, that was, he would, you would take that egg to Heggy, and then they would hatch, and that would get the ice key, I suppose. That's, that's my guess. Oh, this one would be for the ice key? If you didn't have Stop and Swap, they would be three regular eggs. I think you can find the two other eggs in here. I, I, I don't know how, how it works, but... Point is, we got three... Special stop and swap two eggs okay. that don't have any purpose yet. But in the original base game, they would offer they would get you the uh, the extra collectibles like Dragon Kazooie and uh, the uh, the the move where you take Kazooie and you just oh the Briegel Bash down, the Briegel Bash yeah oh there's, there's the other one there's the last one okay ah oh, I like this give me all the secrets. Stop, stop, stop! Ah! Ah! There we go. Wait a minute, I just realized, is Kazooie's voice lower? A little bit, yes. <laughs> oh! Gotta love that, by the way. Infinite just, fire. Just walk into the fire! Come on! Get over here! Come here, you! Ah, uh, come on. Have you ever burned an N64 there. cartridge? That's the gold egg, so whenever they make Banjo 3 or whatever, and they have retroactive Stop and Swap 2 stuff, there you go. I'm telling you, man. E3 2022. For now, all it does is unlock some secret levels and nuts and bolts that I don't give two fucks about. <laughs> and neither should you. <laughs> okay. Because I'm, I'm pretty sure they're not going to be fun. So, all right, now we make our way to the plateau. It's time to start backtracking and get some things that we need. Oh, I don't like this level, though. Yeah, I I don't like it too. In fact, I have actually ranked the, my my favorite level. Oh, well, let's talk about that then. Uh, let me pull it up. I have it somewhere. I have a strange feeling this one's last. Uh, it is not last. What? This this. Oh one's wait, uh, Pterodactyl Land's definitely last. Where did I put it? My head's. No, man. Oh, there it is. All right. Um, Lay it on out me. Of, out of the eight worlds that uh, that 
uh, ban Banjo Tooie has. Oh wow, only eight. Glitter Gulch Mines comes in at number six. Huh. There are two levels I hate more than this. Interesting. But I do hate this level a lot because it it doesn't have it's it's very confusing. It's difficult to maneuver. This is how you get that. Oh, nice. Nice and easy. There's is there's not a lot of good landmarks. No. And there's there's all these different hidden rooms that jet out into random hallways and I spent way too long in here trying to figure out where everything exactly was. <laughs> like mine entry three. What does that tell me? Where exactly is mine entry three? What what's the third entry of the mines? Where does this fucking take me? Well, I believe it takes you to the third. The gloomy caverns. Okay. Uh, okay. Oh yeah, it's this. It's this place with the, yeah, with the the, the shed that we that we blew up. And then we go into the outhouse. Wait, no, it's a power hut. This is the power hut. This is what I messed up the first oh. time because I tried to do it with that. But we're gonna we're gonna do it correctly. At least try to. Okay. Oh, this one. Yes. Okay. Oh right, we didn't get this. No, oh, we didn't. That, no, we didn't. That's nuts. Yeah, I know. All right, I gotta split up for that, right? No, oh, gross. Do you think you think we can do it without it though? I don't, I don't know. I, I think we could. You can, you can turn up the brightness setting on your, on your TV there. I think you should be able to get it. Yeah. Maybe I just gotta do it right. Just a hunch. Just gotta do it right. Mm -hmm. All right. Yeah, I, I, I can see a little oh, bit. Oh, you be, can totally see that. Be fine. Just gotta. Fact, Aha! Got, oh my God, you're cheesing it. And Kazooie's helping me out. You're cheesing it. Yeah. Banjo Kazooie, how could you? <laughs> yeah, let's do it the right way. No, oh, come on. You had some cheese. Delicious cheese. Put it over crackers. Because the real way you're supposed to do it is come over here. Well, maybe not there specifically. Yeah, there we go. Oh, right over here. Okay. Split up pad right there. That's how it's supposed to be done. Just, just, just make it easier for everybody, you know. Who's the one standing on the thing? Oh, Kazooie's standing on the thing. I don't think she can stand on the thing. Oh. Oh. Oh, no, wait. I'm doing something better. Yeah. Still don't need the light. I'm cheesing with Kazooie in a different way. Oh, flying? Or uh, gliding, Let's I get, guess? Get to this first part, then do a backflip. <laughs> and then just glide there. Yes. Yes. There you go. Ah, ah, chain. No, no stop. No. Ah, ah, there we go. The ultimate cheese. Yummy. Delicious. And then we can die. And then, yeah. Because it takes you right back to the split up pack. Speed tra strat. Bleh. Perfect. God, we're going to be flying through this level. Okay. I call that the most efficient way to take care of that problem. Oh, and then the smelly cheese. Oh, wait, we're out of there. Yep, I think I think that was it, too. Oh, wow. Yeah, that was, yeah, that was it. All right. Cool. Into Witchy World. Witchy World, we got uh, a couple of things to do, but we got one big uh, side quest to do, I suppose. This one here? This is Boggy's wife. Her three children are missing. Well, we know where... We know where everyone is, actually. I think they appear in random spots. Well, r random designated spots. Ew. But, and I also think which kid appears where is randomized, too. Because there are three children, and all three of them have... Uh, separate things that they that you need to do in order for them to go back to their mum. Uh, okay. So, let's get to it. First things first. Jump up here and hit this switch here, which opens up the burger joint! Cool! Let's have a burger. You don't want these burgers. Oh. Why do we not want these burgers? Are they made with sadness? Uh... If you want these burgers after uh, talking to the guy, then you feel free. Are they from... rallies? There's the fries place. Do we have the, fries? The switch for the fries place is just behind it. Oh, shoot! <laughs> fries. Oh. Yeah, if I have a restaurant, I'll just put the blinds up and then turn the lights off, but not lock the doors. So when someone comes in... Ah, <laughs> oh, damn it, a customer! Oh, ah, no. come on! <laughs> what a smart... 
smart ass. Salty Joe's Limp Salty Fries. Ew. Okay, so have you seen those Wendy's commercials about the fries? What about them? Well, there's one where they just show a really rundown shack. <laughs> and it's like, one order of fries, please. And, you know, everything's broken. And then there's this one guy giving you, like, old, disgusting, dried-out fries. And then they're like, you don't want fries like that. And then it says, you want Wendy's amazing fries. <laughs> you don't want fries like that. Hey, you don't know me. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe I like crap. Ah, all right. Different things happen when you go in here. This is Madam Grunty's tent. You, you you find out some things, she, she tells you a fortune, and she just, just, stuff happens. Stuff happens. There, I got extra grenade eggs. Then you can go back in. Do you give her the fries? And then, oh, what? No! Ow! Oh. <laughs> And she closes the door on this! <laughs> For refurbishments, get out of here. Whatever, whatever. Oh, that's amazing. Okay. Alright, now to the burger place. Oh. Yeah. Did he just belch on the burger? Oh, no, worse. That's your burger. Burger also is the tastiest burgers in which you won't. Oh, he sneezed on it, ew! How does it you get a job in catering? Check it out, this is my Michelin star. Uh, I don't I like this. I, I, I don't want them, but we need them. Give me burger. Give. Can they legally be called burgers at this point? Give me snot burger. You want fries with that? We'll go to the fry place. Oh, it's yeah. touching the innards of my bag. Yeah. <laughs> oh, gross. Oh, no, I don't like it. At least her tent doesn't stay closed that long, but why would you want to? All right, I gotta remember where these kids are. I know there's one in the in the western area. There's one in the inferno. I forgot what the other one was. Oh, wait, in the jail. Right. Okay. I love how your descriptor of in the inferno... <laughs> It's, it's, that's what it's called. It's in the Inferno. I know it's called the Inferno. It's just really funny to hear. Oh, your child's in the Inferno. I'm not making a what? joke. I'm not making a joke. Oh, you've got fries. Can I have some? Can I? Can I? Here you go. Have some disgusting fries. Yeah, ha have your limp, salty, sad fries. There you go. Okay, what's worse? Limp and salty or hard as a rock? How hard a rock are we talking? I'm talking in the deep fryer for two extra minutes. I kind of like those. Hmm. If, if, like if they're crisp, if, if they're crispier, that's fine. But if they're like impossible to eat, then no. I'm talking like when you bite down on them, they burst into pieces. They become like hard candy. Ooh, I kind of like those. Oh, God. So, uh, yeah. Why are we back in here? We're we're in here for something specific. Just gotta shoot all these balloons. We gotta get 60 of them. 60 of them, okay. Yes. Well, while we're doing this, uh, one thing I keep forgetting to bring up, I actually have it on my phone to remind myself to talk about it during one of these episodes. Are we gonna talk about the allegations? Uh, what? No! <laughs> no! Uh, no, uh, I think it's Grant Kirkhope. He released a rejiggied yes. entire playlist of Banjo-Kazooie 1. I just think that's neat. That is neat. It's too bad I like Grant Kirk. I like uh, David Wise more. Well, it's it's the thought that counts. It is. I'm glad he did. You know, drum up more uh, more interest. And for getting 60, uh, you get an achievement because points make prizes. It's uh, shooting 60 balloons. Okay. Yeah, we're getting all the achievos too. Oh, nice. Congratulations. Get out. This will be a good guide for when I eventually play Banjo-Tooie in the year 2030. When 3E gets announced. <laughs> you think it's getting announced. I don't think. I, I hope. I, I, yeah. Alright, next place. To the Inferno. To the Inferno. 
Turns out it's just a really hot place to get your information. The first, info no. First place we're going is the the jail. La jail. Hi, your mom said to come what? over here. All food must be consumed in the theme park. What? Do we have to sneak it in? Oh. I went into the train station accidentally. There's a sign here that says uh, no food over on the right there. On the right. On, on the on the right. Oh, I see it. Okay, I was just telling you that. I can't take the food from the train station. Okay, cool. I didn't even know that was the train station. It looked like a crypt. Oh, here we go. Alright, let me just come on down here. This is where the jail is. So how is this different from going in the other pathway? What do you mean? I, I mean... It, it, it leads somewhere else. That's, well, I mean, come on. It looks like it's going to the exact same spot, just on the opposite side. It's, it's N64 design. Okay, never mind. Maybe the property line is just slightly different. Different enough. Hey. Oh look, there's a character from uh, Pterodactyl Land here still. There's that kid. Well, this place is great! I'm never going back to Mom! <laughs> Bring Bash. Hey. Respect your <laughs> Respect your parents! I'm off to find my mom and she'll tell my dad, who will then tell his landlord, who will then tell his tax collector, who will then tell the president, and then you're going to jail. So I go to Boggy's house. Hey, did you, uh, did you hurt my son in Witchy World? Gah? Uh -huh. Nice job. <laughs> Good man. Here's five bucks. Yeah. Oh, thank you. No, thanks. Oh, no, no. <laughs> you don't need money. No. Right, so that's the second kid. Ow. This is Snake Way, and it's very hurty. So, I, I'm sorry, I blinked. What did the Triceratops need? It needs a train station back to Pterodactyl Land. Basic, we basically, when I bring the train uh, into into Witchy World, she will get on the train. Gotcha. And okay. then I gotta summon the train again in Pterodactyl Land, and then she'll run back to her parents. Oh, good lord. How did that hurt me? <laughs> it's just a door going down, come on! Doors hurt, man. Duh. Right, there you are. Oh, there's the Inferno, yeah. Oh, how's this kid even gonna get up? Just good, like his dad. Good question, and th this stupid kid is the reason why we had to wait so long to do this. I'll just need a burger before I go find my mom. Can I have a burgy burg? Just because he needed a burger? That is a very unfortunate texture for his pants. Yeah, I think that's reused. It looks <laughs> like it's lo it looks like an unwashed bum hole. Uh-huh. And now this poor kid is too fucking fat to move. Oh, cool. We need to like roll him or something? No, nothing like that. Nothing like that. Uh no. No. Yeah. Get out of here, gotta really? Get the, gotta get, I got to do the taxi pack. That's dumb! That is dumb! <laughs> it's very dumb! <laughs> it's about as dumb as this kid for thinking that that burger tasted good! Oh. Get, Get in, in the here! Bag. Oh god, Banjo, you're gonna have back problems! Oh dear. Fortunately, there's an easy warp back. Okay, so that like is lovely. Uh, no, uh, because this kid was there, you know. That, that, that was just convenience and uh, and good luck on there. Oh, oh jump in on top of him. <laughs> Here's your fat ass Ooh. kid. I think he crushed Banjo, actually. <laughs> How can I run off, Mom? <laughs> You've been eating again. I told you, no eating. <laughs> But moms, I heard starvation's bad for kids. Oh, I love that. He tries to. Yeah, oh, yeah. yeah, yeah. Child abuse, I love it. Kick his ass. Woo! He tried to blame us for this. Yep. Cool. They will now be hanging out in Boggy's house. Just for some extra flavor text, if you want it. We have made enemies of other of another bear clan, basically. 
Jesus, Rare, come on. <laughs> hey, uh, hey, Jim, does our new physics engine work? Well, <laughs> does it ever? Does it Take ever. a look at this! Take a look at this. Oh, I got that, Jiggy, and I, th I think that's it. Really? That's all we had left in Witchy World? Yeah, just that one lone Jiggy, I think. And and the achievements and all that stuff. Oh, but, right, uh, right. Yeah, that, 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 I think that's it. Unless... Oh, wait, we're getting Kazooie. Got oh, it. I should mention that uh, Witchy World on my uh, Yeah, rankings. what's its ranking? Uh, Witchy World is... Yeah, it's probably... Probably keep terrible. Witchy World is actually number two. Really? You like this level? I like Witchy World because oh. it's it's easy to maneuver. There's a central hub, and it's all sectioned out. Over here is Inferno. Over here is Western. Over here is space. Okay. Over here is the other place. Okay, I I can agree with that. Having a hub in a huge level like this actually really does help. And the you know, the jiggies weren't that difficult. I mean, there were these boggy kids, but it wasn't too bad, was it? Wasn't that bad. All right, let's uh, call Chuffy over here to start a pterodactyl land thing. And go. Boy, I need to really make him uh, better at this. Faster. He, he, he needs to work on this. He needs to train. I thought you were going for, I've been working on the railroad. <laughs> There we go. And please say it's automatic. It is yes, automatic. Yes! Yay! <laughs> Thank you. So she just kind of hops into the train and that's it. Well, good. And we gotta take her to Pterodactyl Land and she'll run to her folks. It's all coming together. I yeah. love this part of projects. All right. <laughs> Chuffy, it's right in front of you. Okay, that's pretty funny. Uh, speaking of Pterodactyl Land, is that where we're heading next? Nope. Oh. Oh, I can't. Hmm. Odd. Oh, I'll just head up the all hags then, because that's where we, that's where we need to go next, actually. Again? Yeah. Oh, okay. Because we're heading to the next level, going just going down the list. Bang, 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 bang. I like that. Which means we're heading to Jolly Rogers Lagoon. I like leaving you in charge. You know, let you be the conductor of this train. You're probably wondering why the hell are we in Hail in Hailfire Peaks? Yeah, why the hell are we in Hailfire Peaks? Because we're doing something for Jolly Rogers Lagoon, obviously. Oh right, we unlock the swimming pool by killing a man. That's right. Now this is nice and cool. We can do this, but we still gotta turn it to the bag to hit the switch. So, whoop! I hate this. It's so stupid. Wrong one. <laughs> gotta put it over my head. Wrong bag. So without the C buttons, how are you doing this? The Does stick. The, the stick. The sticks? Okay. Right stick up, right sticks down. Yada yada. Da, 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 da. Then... Oh, it drains it. So all of that Ice Cube's life force is going straight into here. Yep. At last, we can go for a swim. Here, take this piece of gold. <laughs> they stole that from Grunty? Yeah, they did. That's hilarious. Hey, dude. We have only 10 Jiggies left to get. Oh, there's a solid 90. Okay. Mm -hmm. Awesome. I'll take Kazooie back and we'll head through that door and uh, the rest of this is going to be at Jolly Roger Lagoon. <laughs> oh, making up for past mistakes. Well, let's go ahead and rip the band-aid off. What was your rating for this one? Seven. Seven. Seven of eight. Second to worst. Second to worst. Yeah, I can see it. There was uh, quite a bit we did not get done here. Th this on land section is what kept it from being the worst of the worst. There was stuff for you to do. I totally forgot about this. I even saw it when we were actually here, when we yeah. were doing the actual episode. I was like, wait, no, you idiot! I was editing, I'm like, oh no! <laughs> oh no! I was Lying. really fed up with this world! No, no, no. Uh -huh. Okay. Alright. Oh. Oh, is there. Come around here. There's a grip grab up there, isn't oh, there? Oh, wow. We're going all over the place. We are indeed. So, when you came up with these rankings, was it 
as you were playing the game or right now as you were doing cleanup? As I was backtracking, yes. Okay. Now that I've done all the worlds and it's like, let's let, let's rank them all. Number seven is Jolly Roger Lagoon because <gasps> while I hated it and it's the least done, it's still not as bad as the, uh, as, you know. As a certain level. As a certain level, yes. That I think I know what it is. I think, I think you might know. I think uh, I, 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 it's not going to be that difficult to, mm -hmm. to guess, I'm sure. And how ironic that it has the visage of a, of a cock and balls. Uh -huh. <laughs> because, hey! I, because I kept getting dicked around. Exactly. Good job on getting that honeycomb piece, by the way. Well, thanks. All right, now we uh, do a little oh, split up. Sign for Kazooie. Sign for Kazooie to do some stuff here. Yes, let the dragon do it. This is a precursor to Spyro. Wait a minute. The, Hold on. When did Spyro come out? So this isn't me, uh, you know, doing stuff that we. Well, right now it's doing stuff that we missed. Oh. The first thing we need to do is we we need to glide. We had yeah. to wait a long time before we got that. And there we go. Oh, I thought you missed it. <laughs> So close. So did I. Woo. Oh, precision. Oh, right. We need to come back here and kill some fish. <laughs> oh, you gotta be kidding me. You need banjo I for need, this. I need banjo for this. Terrible. You have the ability. Why can't you just use it without the, br the bear? I almost said the bird. There's still some things we can do as Kazooie. Alone. Go into Mumbo's hut here. Oh, really? There's a crack in the wall. Oh. No way. Yep. Uh, well. <laughs> you can uh, see this in another part of the level. Mm -hmm. I, th I think where you get uh, where, where a molehill is. But this is the turtle sanctuary. Turtles. Hmm. Oh, hi. Hello, Tip Top. Oh my god, that is Tip Top. 32 weeks late. <laughs> Uh, don't know how to tell you this? Assume the worst. Uh-huh. He's supposed to get out himself. I'm a reptile, not a bird. I... I, you, I can't help you, you here, dude. But you, 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 me I, with the... I had a metamorphosis. So do that. Uh, how do you hatch C up or C down? Nope, not that <laughs> down. Oh, no! <laughs> they actually had dialogue for this. That's great. <laughs> oh, that's so great. Anyway, how do I, hatch. Uh, there it is. Uh, just... Put a little booty on there, and there you go. Brains. Brains. Thank you so much. Something looks odd. Well, <laughs> that face. You mean he's tipped up? Now he's tipped up. Is that where they got the name? I think they just did all that for that joke. Either way, we get a jiggy. Hooray! Yay! Alright. Hooray! Uh, oh. <laughs> See, I thought he was actually going, okay, time to be in peril again. Fucking show off. Man, I gotta crawl my way in. <laughs> I hate you, Dad. Alright, that's that's a thing. Cool. He left. Wow. Moving on. Well, most of what we're missing is uh, pages and stuff. I think there's like one more jiggy here, I think. Maybe two. We still have to kill the fish, yeah? No, we, we killed the fish. We killed Woo Fuck Fuck. But <laughs> no, the, no, no, no. But the, the other ones. The, inv the invisible fish? The, yeah, the, 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 the invisible seamies. fish. Yeah, because I didn't know how to work the torpedoes, but now I do! So let's get all them! Yeah! With knowledge gained through the entire game, it's time to kill fish. Invisa fish. Wait, this is Atlantis? What a dump. I know, right? Sheesh. So just swim around and see if we can find uh, some places here. Oh, because there are places. I'll tell you what. First thing here is a torpedo ah. door. It's, just, it's all centered around the torpedo, a move I hate the most. Can you please use this brand new move? We spent so much time programming it. You gotta use it to open the doors, you gotta use it to, uh, to blow open the, the, the teeth of the fish to enter and save that one person. Please it's use it. Oh, great. Oh, this could- oh, god, bad flashbacks. 
Wait, yeah, I'm wait, just gonna torpedo worked? right through that it. That worked? This is easy. That, uh, this is working? Yeah, this is easy. Just torpedo right through these things. Don't even gotta think about no- <laughs> I knew it. Alright, I'll do it correctly. I, th I thought I was being smart, too. I, I, Ow! I, I, I then tried to, like, you know, ram Kazooie into it. Mm-hmm. But... Well, I'm assuming you need to torpedo the red point. I tried that, I don't think it worked. Maybe you gotta fire, like, an egg or something like that, I don't know, but because of Honeyback, I can just brute force my way through. That is amazing. <laughs> what if this was actually the intended solution? If it was, then I'm a smarty. Because that's how we get the last Jinjo in Glitter Gulch Mine. And now we actually have to go all the way back. There's no Come way on. up. It's a one-way truck. Oh, off. It is faster to just restart the game. <laughs> uh, oh, this is me realizing how much how bad I fucked up. Yeah, I see so, your agony. Back at it. Yeah. Kill the invisible fish? Is that what we're hunting, or did I just dream that? So one more thing to do here, the ancient swimming baths. He's coming to take a bath, get him! This is another glide section. I like gliding. That's probably why I enjoyed Spyro so much. That's why I like ukulele at the end. Because you could just fly anywhere. No pads or nothing. No feathers even. Just... Just fly. Toss Lele in the air and start flying. So, Spe speaking of which, since uh, nuts, nuts and bolts is out of the out of the cards, out of the question, you mean? Out of the question. Uh, ukulele win. I I like ukulele a lot. Maybe more so than most other people do. And well, well I wouldn't mind trying. I wouldn't mind doing that. Sure. It's not in the cards right now, but it's in the deck. I'm sure. Maybe after a while. After a while, I need I need a banjo break. <laughs> <laughs> well, especially after this, because it has been. Uh, and this isn't because of your gameplay or anything, but it feels like this game is such a slog compared it, to the first one. It is. And it's, it's, it's because they put too much in there. I think Rare got burned out. I legitimately think they got burned out after making game after game after game like this. It's, it's, it's just, just too much. Well, it's all the arbitrary padding that I can't get over. Yeah. It's like, oh, hey, we, we have a move in the last level for a Jiggy right now. I, I hope you enjoy it when you eventually get here. But ukulele, it, instead of having nine big levels with too much stuff to do, they only have five enormous levels with plenty to do. And the more you and the more you play, the more maneuverability you get, such <laughs> as being able to fly at the very end. Ah, uh, revenge! Get him! Get him! <laughs> Okay. Just gotta just do it, gotta, do just, it right. just gotta, gotta aim. Uh, yep, there got we go. it. All right. Well, awesome. And I'm pretty sure that's all the honeycombs. Oh, in the game. Yes, yeah, pretty pretty sure. I think think that is all. Uh. Yeah, yeah, that's it. Nice. That's it. So your final health count is thirteen or twelve. Twelve sounds right. Twelve. That's a good, good number. So let's come back down here and do it right. <laughs> oh, yeah! <laughs> oh, that's a Cheeto page in there. Yeah, that's a pagey. Pagey, excuse I, me. I, I mean, yeah, it's a page. A pagey is what you get in ukulele. Oh, right. Cause instead, they're... Of, instead of Jiggies. Because mm. it's, it's a spell book. I will say, though, Impossible Air is leagues better than ukulele. Well, now they're coming out with an official sequel of Ukulele. Really? Ukulele 2. Yes! Oh, I'm excited about that. Hell yeah! Hopefully they they learn their lesson from one and Impossible Lair to make a really damn good sequel. And if it ends up anything like this, <laughs> we have learned nothing. I don't know. They got, they got, they got good folks uh, at Playtonic now. I liked, I mean, I, I liked Tika Lightly, it was fine. <laughs> defensive? I'm not defensive. <laughs> You're defensive! <laughs> Why are you attacking me?! I was expecting a little more, a uh, little more YouTuber in that- Why are you attacking me?! <laughs> okay. A little more YouTuber? Okay. <sighs> hey guys. No, 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 I didn't so... say apology, I meant oh, oh. full-on ramp mode. <laughs> right. <laughs> 
So this is uh, Grunty Industries. This is the other level that Jolly Roger Lagoon hooks oh, up to. Oh yeah, it, it feels like going through a bunch of razor blades. Remember in Hailfire Peaks we had to go through that pipe to get that one jiggy? Yeah. Well now we gotta go through the pipes over here oh. to get uh, Jinjo, I believe. Okay, sure. Oh, yep. You heard hear, that one. You hear him? Yep. Oh wait, go go back down. Oh, he's 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 down below. There he is. There he is. I think that's the last blue Jinjo. Yep. Yeah. Five left. Are those all the Jinjos? I think that might be all of the Jinjos too. Oh my God! Cleaning everything up. Yeah. Yeah, we got that one from there. It's, yeah. That's, wow. Wow. Cool, cool, cool. <laughs> I love the well, brute force strategy. <laughs> that's what I'll tell me got for for right now. <laughs> it's so funny. So next time... Ow! <laughs> Ow! <laughs> so next time Ow! on... Next time on Banjo-Tooie, <laughs> we're gonna handle the rest of the cleanup, and then we're gonna get to finally finishing this game. Say exciting times. See you then. <laughs>